Okay, so I do quite like this chap bald, but let's throw some hair on him. Now looking at some of the pictures that I've drawn, drawn um, I think we might try and create this one here. So let's go about that. Okay, so I'm going to select the face. And how do we've got it? It's kind of goes up, straight, beautiful. So let's add a circle. And I'm just going to kind of put up here. Let's raise it up a bit. All right, so I'm going to keep it to about here. Let's just make that a little bit bigger and we'll raise the hair up. So I'm going to keep all these vertices and delete vertices. Extrude X, extrude Y, extrude, whoops, extrude X, extrude Y, oh, rotate, extrude Y, and then extrude uh, let's go delete vertice select these two face control L but that doesn't look right to my drawing so with my drawing I actually kind of have it coming up a bit so delete edge select all that control L G whoops G Y and let's go size on the Y just to make that a little bit bigger. We don't want that to go so down low. And extrude. And yeah, let's now face that off. Face. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to W subdivide and I'm just going to increase that number to 10 and then I might just subdivide it one more time and let's select some random points. I am going to proportional editing. So I'm going to click down here and select connected. So what we've got the option here is proportional editing editing. If I press G, uh, you kind of see nothing much in this view. But if I use the mouse wheel and zoom in a bit, it kind of selects those vertices and whatever's around it. So I'm going to right click to cancel that. So here we've got the options of what type of proportional editing we can use. Um, I'm going to select random because I'm going to try and get the spikiness. And we're just picking up so I go up, I could probably go up a little bit. And then that'll give us that kind of like spikiness there. Press O and O again to turn off that proportional editing. So we're back to normal, disabled. I am going to control L and we will do a face on that. Let us create a new material, new, and go hair. Let's just give the chap some brown hair. Assign. Oops. Assign. Control N. Inside. Ah. So I forgot to change that again. Control L. Control N. Inside. So now we've kind of got uh, we've got this hairdo. Obviously here we've got some really 90 degree edges. So what we did again with the shoe, I'm going to extrude. And everything I kind of want to just round off, I'm going to select these edges. Control B. Let's use the mouse wheel a little bit. That looks a little bit better. Select that with the Alt, delete vertices, and we're back to our. Cool. So that doesn't look too bad. So let's leave it there.